Hello, welcome to Ion Entertainment. I'm Donnelly Heising, and today we're proud to welcome Dr. Jack Fujimoto. Okay, Dr. Fujimoto, you were the first mainland United States Japanese American college president. How, how did this happen, and what hurdles did you have to overcome? Well, I've always had in my mind that I wanted to be a uh, academic uh, president of a college institution in the United States. And, you know, in Hawaii, they, have, they had several uh, college presidents who were Asians or Japanese American, you know, like uh, uh, Kiyosaki, rich, mm -hmm. rich dad, poor dad. He was a poor dad. Uh, <laughs> there was uh, uh, guys like uh, Shigetomi and uh, Miyasato and those people. But I was uh, trying to be the first mainland uh, president, and so when I was in Hawaii with my kids mm -hmm. and the family, next thing you know, they phoned me and they said, uh, you want to be an applicant? Yeah, I had already applied. But then for them to call me in vacation and then say, okay, uh, you want to come and interview and so on. So I left Kauai, I went to LA, had to get my clothes, go to Sacramento. And finally, after uh, maybe two, three weeks, I finally got the call that uh, uh, there were going to be two of us, an affirmative action candidate who was a lady out of Fresno and myself. And it was really, uh, affirmative action really wanted uh, women at that time. And so therefore I thought, well, you know, heck, that's, that's the end of that line. But uh, I survived. And out of that, I became the first uh, uh, Japanese American, Asian American president of uh, Sacramento City College. And Sacramento City College has a very rich history, you know, Mm -hmm. Founded in 1913, and it was a farm school for uh, people going to Berkeley and Stanford. So, you know, for me, it was really prestige, I thought. Oh, yeah, that's great. So that was 1977. 1977.